meeting colleagues from all over the world, five continents, been absolutely brilliant. New ideas, new friends, yep, I can recommend that 100%. Ricardo thinks out of the box. Now, I've been following implant dentistry for 20 years. I've been placing loads of implants, and he's doing things that I want to achieve, what I really wish to give my patients, but I'm not there yet. And he's managing to do that. And it's been nice to know it's reachable with the mic skills I've got now, just a change of ideas. The uh, biggest advantage of this course was that Ricardo presented the material in a very didactic way. Mm -hmm. So even for me, the remedy you buy in periodontal surgery was so easy to understand all the steps. What surprised me was the consistency of Ricardo. He showed us more than uh, 100 cases. Every case was perfectly managed and with magnific outcome. Yeah. Uh, if you show me many cases, uh, it means uh, that you have the skin in the game every day and uh, you are consistent and the procedure is repeatable yeah. and eventually teachable. Yeah. Yeah. So you get suspicious if you only see one face. Yeah, pretty, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And again, we are giving here the shape of the gum contour. You are trying to work with symmetry. You know, I'm, I'm not a surgeon. I'm a restaurative general dentist, so actually I came here to find out all the possibilities. You know, what can I do? What can I expect from my colleague who is doing the surgery? This is exactly the brilliant cause for us. Why is it brilliant for you? Because both topics are covered, actually prosthetics and, and surgery. And, and are you surprised how important the, the play of them together is? Exactly. I came here with the high expectations in the course because I do a lot of surgeries already. Yeah. And what I feel like is even for the experienced surgeon, I'm, I'm refining the skills that I, I have. I know how to avoid complications and how to refine my suturing technique as well. On the other hand, Ricardo turned out to be an amazing prosthodontist. And this is very nice because for me, I want to learn the other part, even if I'm not going to do it a lot, but I can communicate with the restoring dentist even. And now, if the tissue is stable, we're talking to people and they're saying, you're doing a master's in soft tissue, why do you need to do Ricardo's course? And I said, well, actually, I think he can bring something that actually you won't be taught on other courses. If you want to achieve precision and actually you want to go to the next level, and then this is the course. I'm an oral surgeon. I've been doing oral surgery for 20 years plus. When you're doing oral surgery, you come from an oral surgery background, you lose some, if I can say this, some finesse because you're more interested in the big volumes of bone and big movements, but it doesn't give you what the patient really wants. It's that final finish. And this is what the course is about. Ricardo gives that final touch. Now, when we sat down over dinner, he told me it's his passion, it's his life, it's his hobby, and it shows. You have a difference between the level here and here. But you cannot have difference between the level of the tissue here and here. I would say the level of detail and going back to basic principles, just physiology and actually how to take that into account and then use it has been fascinating. Have a bit more confidence, but planning so that you hopefully won't be having to do so many reconstructions later and having to deal with defects. That implant will never need, need anything else done to it, which should be much easier. <laughs> I'm even now excited to go and implement the things I learned. I do teaching, actually. Yeah. I'm happy that I'm going to also refine other uh, resident skills in the program. The technique for the impression and how to maintain the gingival contour and uh, be very precise about the data that we have in the gingival architecture and how he's managing to transfer like, the jaw relations without screwing up the gingival architecture. Just doing some hands-on on the tip saw and I brought some sutures and uh, you know, as many mistakes I make, I think that that's more valuable experience. Well, I don't get to do that on the patient's mouth, I only have one shot. And seeing someone, no matter what field they're in, working to such an excellent standard just gets you excited and enthused about uh, trying to be excellent yourself. If you want to uh, learn about soft tissue surgery, so you know what's available or you want to improve your skills or want to start your journey, uh, this course will do all of those things for you. Yeah, I, I think uh, it's a must. Uh, I did a lot of pedio courses during the years, uh, uh, and the most didactic one was that from Ricard, honestly. Yeah, I come back at my office with a basket of tips and tricks uh, to apply soon. Yeah. It's exceptional value for money. It's a brilliant course. I'm certain that I'll recoup the money by taking procedures and doing treatments that I wasn't previously doing. There's no value for this really, it's priceless.